The black market, the market is so black that when you pay for your items and leave, we don't give a damn if you don't come back. No, I'm just messing with you though. Play me some of that, man. Let that flow get right. It sound like you got money right here. You know who I put on there? Who that? Morris Day. Really? Ooh. I might not even, I might just have him talk the shit on it. Oh yeah. Oh, that'd be great. Yeah. I wonder what Morris Day is doing right now. Where He's Morris on Day tour is? still. I'm pretty sure. Pretty Out there Morris singing, Day. Gigolos Get Lonely too. <laughs> 93 11. Yeah. Come on, man. Well, J-O-N, without further ado, I think it's time to let the people know that the black market is back open. One more time. One more time. Now, look. I had no idea. I was walking through the black market. I had just had some donuts. I know the donut man. I know the donut man. Now this is crazy. This is evolution at its finest right here. Now the first time he was on the black market, he showed up as the donut man mm -hmm. and had everybody spazzing out over the donuts. He had Reese's Pieces and all kind of Homer Simpson donuts with the sprinkles on them. Then he had some chocolate shit in him. Brought a bear claw and some cinnamon some and then had one with just like mm. some naked sugar on it. That shit was good. What was that shit with the brown? Man, mm -hmm. it was all kind of candy mm -hmm. donuts and shit. And they had like, they had, they wasn't them, them like them, them, them donuts that's full of air. These motherfuckers had some, some dough on them. And some girth to it. Yeah, you know I don't want to say it like that. I ain't want to sign up. Damn it, you, all my hard work is ruined now. All my, I, I was doing everything with, <laughs> For it not to go that way, and here you go. But see, that's why you're the cooking man, and now and you can get away with that. Welcome back to the black market, my man. Come on, thank great. You. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for having me. I appreciate it. First of all, this is probably one of the biggest switch ups since Michael Jordan went from playing basketball to baseball. What, what are you doing now? I'm trying to get in because. You know, being on the black market, and obviously, y'all nationwide. Right. So a lot of people saw your show, and they're like, oh, man, I really want to go get their donuts. But if they not in Atlanta and 10th Street, they can't come give me that dollar for the donuts. So I was like, how can I make a product that's good enough that can go nationwide, and people can hear about it on the black market, and then they can go buy it? So I was thinking, what's a product that I really loved as a kid? You know, I'm a baker. I really love these cookies called Magic Middles. Keebler used I like to make the, a, I love the name. Because well, I know him. I well, that's gonna, the thing. I, didn't I ain't going to do it. I, I ain't going to do it. I didn't come up with the name. Yeah. It was a Keebler product. It used to come out in the 90s. Keebler used to make this cookie called Magic Middles in the 90s, and it, they discontinued it. So they discontinued it when I was thinking, how can I expand my brand? And I love baking. How can I make something I really loved? And I thought, why don't I revive these cookies? So I went and looked for the trademark. It was discontinued, bought the trademark, and then been working on the recipe for years, and now finally brought it out. So, here we go. <laughs> now I held off, because I didn't know this was these was your cookies. People been eating them all day in here. <laughs> yeah, like they done went through at least five packs of these. <laughs> Everybody been on these cookies hard. I've seen it. So you saying you was on the black market and you was like, I need to sell some of them right now. Yeah. I need three percent. <laughs> I need 3%. I inspired you. Well, at least hook me up with a free couple boxes of cookies or oh, something. I can get Just you cookies, a, donuts, send me a all day long. Or something, man. Shit. I ain't ate none yet because I was going to eat some mm -hmm. in real time and yeah, see yeah, what yeah. you was doing with the cookie game. Okay. Bro. So what? is this your first cookie or is this what you about to start this? a cooking line? Or yes, what? that's the goal. Let's start a whole line. I'm trying to be the gourmet black little Debbie. You know what I'm saying? So that's the idea. A whole 
bacon line where it's gourmet, it's high end, but it's made by, you know, black folks for us, by us, yeah. and put ourselves on the cover, you know what I'm saying? Instead of a key little elf, you got a little Kamala on there. So that's what we're trying to do. And so this was the first cookie, and hopefully it can launch. So it's a crisp, it's a crisp hard cookie outside, and it's got a chocolatey center inside. So that takes a lot of science and engineering to really get that. Now, perfect. if I wanted to do a collab yes, sir. cookie, what okay. would I have to do? I got my own budget. <laughs> a collab cookie. Uh, you know what? I haven't thought about that. We just have to sit down and chop it up. I mean, look, they I got vanilla wafers, right? Yes. But they don't have no Caucasian cookie. <laughs> Come on, hold on. So, so I'm confused. How is the call? So the what? Yeah, a Caucasian <laughs> cookie, right? They've been playing with the idea the whole time. So, so What's a vanilla wafer? Yes. It ain't, what's a wafer? That ain't, it's kind of a cookie, it's right? It's kind of a cookie. See, but I'm coming out with the whole Caucasian so we cookie. Do Guess a... what? The ass flat on it. <laughs> <laughs> I like this idea. But I feel like they already got vanilla wafers. We just rebranding it. Nope. And saying Caucasian cookie. It's nothing cookie. like a vanilla wafer. How are we gonna make it different, though? I don't want to say it online. <laughs> okay. We'll rap, though. Because what I like with this is, you know, we can play around with any flavor, any filling. So you name what your favorite flavor is, and we can see if we can come up with a Carlos Miller okay. cookie. We can have him right down the cover. It can be you holding the roller I want to take mine to the hood. <laughs> I want to come out with one. I mean, that is the future. Hit me out, don't. Hit me out with the strawberry middle. Ooh, that's, that's the good. flavor name, Squirrelberry. I like that. I like that. It's only been like exclusive to urban markets. When we get, when we go international mm -hmm. with Squirrelberry, because mm -hmm. it's like you know regular strawberry. It's mm, take kind of, but Squirrelberry, Squirrelberry, make so it say it different. So it's gonna be a straw Squirrelberry center, Squirrelberry center, vanilla wafer outside. You getting the cookies confused. This is a whole nother oh, cookie. This is, oh, this is another cookie. You okay. see what I'm saying? I yeah, ain't yeah. want to pal too much. Okay, you don't talk want to, cook. to me. Talk to me. Okay, I like it. Strawberry, the whole yeah. junk. I like it. Yeah. I mean, strawberries. Strawberry. Strawberries. Strawberry. strawberry. Yeah. I mean, that's our number one selling donut at the donut mm. shop, the strawberry and cream. I'm thinking, like, you know how the cookies come in two rows? Yes, sir. Light skinned, dark skinned. <laughs> 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 oh, Hold no. on. What if we call the cookie Red Bones? Okay. Thick. Thick. Get three cookies in yes. a pack. Yes. <laughs> yes. See, now we talking. I like it. Strawberry cookies. They'd be strawberry and they'd be light tan. We call How about Red this? Bones. Check this out. Look where I'm going they'd be now. be thicker than your average cookie. Look where I'm That'd going. Be the name. Thicker than your average cookie. Yeah. Come on. Now look. <laughs> okay. Now you know we black people. We yes, gotta sir. get into the animal cracker market too, right? Okay. We need a celebrity endorser. Who that? Meg the Stallion. <laughs> Our own animal crackers called Meg the Stallions. Meg the Stallions, that's good. That's good, I like this. We about to do something here. Everybody, go check us out. This is gonna be big, okay? I like this, okay? Then we go we go pitch this to Lil Wayne. Uh-huh. Lil Tunchies. Lil Tunchies. But what is a little Tunchy? They like they like Teddy Grams, Ooh. but they just Lil Wayne's. Ooh, that is good. Little, little chocolate tunchies. cookies with like caramel or some shit <laughs> dreads. I like that little Like the cookie brown, but the dreads. <laughs> I like that little Tunchy's. Okay. Mm-hmm. I like this brainstorming stuff. This is good. We throw another one. Who? Lil Uzi Vert. Lil Uzi Vert. Lil Uzi's. <laughs> Why is it Uzi? It's because it's oozing out? Nah, because they just Lil Uzi cookies. Lil Uzi's cookies. But they just all mixed up. It's the rainbow <laughs> ones with little sprinkles, <laughs> then it's some little chocolate chip ones, then some strawberry ones in there. It's like all mixed up. All the okay. cookies, different colors, like Christmas cookies. I like this. I see, see that's why you successful. Yeah. Because that was just off dome. Yeah. See, I've been working on this cookies for a long time. Right. I come in here, sit with you five minutes, and I got five solid ideas already. Come on, okay? man. Come on. <laughs> okay. That's what I like. That's why I like chopping it up with folks. 
I'm telling you. It's good. Okay. Okay, I see the future here. Bro, it, we can do this shit all day. We can. We can do some Donald Trump cookies. Guess what they gonna be? I don't be? know about that now. Little pussies. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, see, I got it. And then we can say, grab him by the pussy. So when you get a pet, grab him the pussy. <laughs> Come on, man. There we go. I already see the little bag with the cut into a little triangle with the little coochies in it. And Walmart it's like selling hair. them, too. Get a big tub of little pussy. <laughs> they probably fly off the shelves. I think they will. Actually, that, that may go both sides. Both sides of the aisle want that one. You feel me? <laughs> OK. Silver okay. rice cookies. OK. Colored only. <laughs> Colored only cookies. <laughs> OK. OK. Yeah, man. You put, the, vanil you the, put the cookies on one side, the vanilla on the other side, segregate them. But see, they already got a cookie like that. They got a black and white cookie. That no, I'm saying it's the like market. the cookie's over here, but all the middles is over there. You got to put it together. You got to put your own cookie mm. together. Like everybody had Oreo, mm, but bring, you ain't never you, had the privilege. Oh, you bringing them together. OK. <laughs> yeah. So then when you have a pack at your house and you give it to a friend, you can see how they eat the cookies. If they keep them separate. You know they ain't your real friend. <laughs> <laughs> Say, no, you got to mix those up. Bro, okay. I can't believe you're in the cookie game. Yeah, I'm proud man. of you, man. I, I feel, appreciate it, man. Hey, man. I appreciate it, man. J.O.N., you, you done ate two packs of these by your damn self. <laughs> I actually had waited, man. I, I'll try one with hey, you. Hey, man, y'all want to have some cookies? Yeah, man. Nah, we're going to, hey, man, huh? Get everybody get a pack. <laughs> <laughs> I want everybody to have some cookies, man. Mm. I want everybody to have some cookies. Yeah, we spread I'm giving cookies. all your cookies away. Y'all hey, got, got some? Cookies. Great, you got some? I got more great, cookies. Great don't eat cookies. He can't. He, I hate him, dog. <laughs> he, cause he's like, he won't, he won't stand up and goddamn do the pledge of allegiance with us. Yeah. He won't have a cookie. <laughs> he don't drink liquor. He don't do. Man, he this just is a crazy thing. The pledge of allegiance. I, but I'm scared of what he is gonna be down with. I don't know. <laughs> I'm with you on that pledge of allegiance. It'd probably crazy be the first motherfucker swing on somebody. We get into it. <laughs> Yeah, so you can take it on the go. When you open up a pack, they still fresh. It's a crisp, hard cookie outside. Creamy chocolatey filling in the middle. Hell yeah. So you can take it, put it in your bag, put it in your pocket, give it to a friend, put it in your purse. Like if you just walked by and this cookie was on the dresser, you would think this was birth control. <laughs> <laughs> About you know, the same size. And you width. may get in trouble with your lady if you have cookie wrappers on the bench. Like, who you bum by here? And you know the best thing about it, they smell fresh. Mm hmm. They hidden? Okay, bet. Good. <laughs> Good. Everybody go to Amazon, okay? If you're in the Atlanta area, DoorDash, get the cookies right to you. Word? Yeah, we on Amazon Prime, so you can go on Amazon Prime. We can go on DoorDash, and there's a new website out. We're gonna be on Nourish soon, so What's check that out. What's the social media? Too. Social media, uh, Magic Middle Cookies. You can go to Magic Middle Cookies, magicmiddles.com, Magic Middle Cookies. Go to Sublime Kamal. That's my personal Instagram, S-U-B-L-I-M-E-K-A-M-A-L. Uh, Magic Middle Cookies on Instagram. Check us out. We're doing a lot of fun things. And, you know, go holler at Walmart, Publix, Kroger, and tell them, please put these cookies in the store. Come on, man. You know, that's what we're trying to do. Because once these cookies launch, then we're coming out with the little Uzis, OK? We're coming out. <laughs> With the Meg the Stallions. <laughs> I mean, I, I really like the red bone, okay? Come on, man. Stick With it in your average milk. cookie. Yeah, exactly. Stick it in your average cookie, you know what I'm saying? Stick so it like in your that. average cookie. <laughs> so I like that, okay? <laughs> so that's the future, okay? We own to something right now, okay? Right. We may not crack this cookie market right here Bro, today. Bro, we could okay? do like some Cardi B's. Uh-huh. They could be like just little cookies with a little honey on them. Okay. Well, I rap later on. Yeah, we'll yeah. We're we gonna figure this out. I got out. ideas. We're gonna and figure this out. And you got the venue. Yeah, yeah. We're gonna figure this out, man. We're gonna figure this out. We gotta that. come out with our own cookie, man. Yeah, man. They got birthday cake, but it ain't got yellow cake with chocolate icing, okay? Okay. I've been selling him for years. I'm gonna change the whole birthday cake game. 
Uh-huh. We bringing back birthday cakes for, for grown people. Okay. I like it. Hey, man. Yeah. You ain't missed yet. <laughs> That's you ain't the goal. Man, that's the goal, man. This, it's, this business is hard, and that's why I appreciate y'all having this black market to support uh, black entrepreneurs, because it's hard out here to really launch a product, to do anything, you know, you gotta invest your time, and we don't got the capital resources like white folks got to really bust it out. So having platforms like this, and you know, really, you know, helping us grind it out, and you know, that's a beautiful thing, man. I want you to keep going. Thank you. I want that's you to keep attacking this dessert market. Oh, we're going to do it, man. We're going to be the gourmet Petridge Farm. I believe in you. Going to take down Oreo, OK? Oreo's the number one cookie on the market. Soon, Magic Metal's going to be the Is number it? one. Yeah. How you know it? In this retail game, they got things called category leaders. Mm -hmm. So here's the crazy part. Here's a little inside baseball on retail stores and stuff. When the grocery store, so you go to Publix, Kroger's, they got things called category leaders. So whoever's the sells the most in that category, they get to choose where everybody else is on the shelf. So if like you got a chip come out, you know, wraps, if you own wrap snacks or something and you want to put your chips in Kroger, Doritos is going to be like, no, nah, we want them right there at the bottom. You know what I'm saying? We're going to put all, we're going to take all these rows of Doritos <laughs> and they can go right there. So Oreo's the big player in the cookie game. So, you know. So you got to know who the boss is so you can try to get to him, get, right. get to that level. So now right. we're trying to figure out. So they're the category leader. So hopefully, you know, Oreo, we coming up. Don't try to hide us. We coming for you. You know what I'm saying? Well, once we're the category leader, support, you know we putting saying? their ass on the floor anyway. Because <laughs> I want all three of my percentage from the cookie game. Well, bro, man, I'm proud of you. Keep yeah, doing your I thing. You know you always welcome on the thank black you, market. Thank hey, you. Hey, donuts, cookies. I don't know what we're doing next. I don't know. We shit. Whatever we do next, hopefully Cereal. I can launch it right here. Every time I do something next, I would love the opportunity to say it first here if y'all would have me, man. Come on, be, man. Let's, appreciate let's it, man. get in the cereal game. Yes, sir. And then toast the strudel. We on your ass. Oh, oh, that'd be great. Oh, I could do that. Yeah. Oh, I like that. Hell yeah, we need to come out with some black Gordon, gourmet dinner rolls too, but that mm -hmm. might be a whole nother. No, that's that's great. I mean, that I like that idea a lot. I mean, can do. We, be, we, we can mean, still we, spin on, because everyone likes the potato bread and right. the King's Hawaiian. We do a sweet potato rolls. Shit, man. Turn these cameras off, kid. <laughs> man, when me and you get to kicking shit, it be sounding crazy, and then we're going to see it. Yeah. All right, man. Hey, mm -hmm. me and you, yes, shit, sir. we might have to go to the trademark <laughs> office or something, man. Hey, the black market is over, man. Thank you. Shit. I got a new favorite cookie, and it's made by a black dude. <laughs> black dude cookies. Black dude cookies. Have you ever had a cookie that was made by a black dude?